Hello! Know that the uh, Accelerator uh, Release 6 is out, uh, the pre-processing release. We have obtained some uh, new ways of working with Accelerator and a new workflow that I want to show you. So um, now you can uh, create a new project directly from Accelerator. Uh, select your area of interest um, and edit the land cover roughness values and then extract and convert those uh, land cover and elevation values. So, so <clears throat> here is the new dashboard. In the top here, uh, you see the subscription details and here you see project that has been run in this account. So uh, now we added the new advanced project here. Uh, upload project um, um, that can be used if you have a project that has been run up to terrain in uh, Vincent desktop. But here I will show you the new advanced project. So let's select Trollstein. Uh, that's an um, area in uh, Spitsbergen that I will show you. Um, and uh, now we will be taken to the map module um, that's based on um, an underlying um, ArcGIS um, technology and it uses the SRIDE datasets. So here we see the map, you can scroll around on it. So let's find our area. So let's say we want to put some markers here. So these markers could either be turbines or a meteorological mast. And then you see that the um, orange uh, bar has been created around them. That is very, and that uh, <coughs> encompasses the refinement area. This is the area we expect there, we expect it to be accurate um, simulation results. And then you see 10 kilometers around there, you have the black bar. <clears throat> the black line, and uh, that means that um, and that is the buffer zone. So, and here you can edit something, here you can add in the coordinates for the corners, you can change the size of the refinement area, for example. <clears throat> and then we have the roughness values. And those are um, representing the terrain and how the terrain affects the wind flow. Let's say if we know this valley here and um, that is flooded with vegetation and this is a um, built area. But uh, we know that this should be <coughs> a tiny bit smaller. So. And then like this, you can add, change the values of the, of the um, terrain types. So now we are done and we push extract terrain. So uh, while this is running, 